Hi, my name is Kira Weiss and I'm a graduate student in ethnomusicology here at UCSB. As a TA, I lead discussion sections of the Intro to World Music general education class in the arts. In this short video, I'll walk you through an assignment that I give to students as a creative option to their weekly written journal responses about course content. The creative option allows students to create about 30 seconds of audio that reflects their engagement with the course lectures and readings. I have flexible guidelines that allow students to be creative not only in the content, but in the way they structure their audio responses. Along with their 30 seconds of audio, students are also asked to write a few sentences explaining the content of the audio and how it connects to course themes. For this project, I took it personally and thought of the way that I interpret art, and I do dance, and I remembered a certain type of dance that's called step, and it's making music with your body, and reading in the passages we learned about musicking, so I used my body as a form of music through dance. It's important to have uh, creative options in art GE projects because it's a more hands-on experience and you get to actually feel it rather than just listening to a professor lecture and reading it through texts. Part of the idea behind this creative option assignment is to get students to share their creative ideas with one another both online and in class. In our discussion section, we listen to the compilation track and fellow students comment on the work of others in real time using the commenting tools in SoundCloud. The idea here is not so much to provide constructive criticism, but to treat the audio as an avenue into discussion. I encourage students to think about how each audio bite makes them reflect differently on topics that we've covered in the course. Their comments on specific time markers within the SoundCloud file then become parts of dialogue, or pluralogue really, where everyone gets to comment, question, and reflect. Ultimately, this is an exercise in student-centered, multimodal learning through creative process. With a hands-on approach, students can engage with music from around the world in direct ways. With easy access to free software like GarageBand and online sound samples, everyone can be, and I would argue, already is, a musician. This creative option is not confined to the world of music, however. Other arts classes can take similar routes with online creation, distribution, and feedback. I encourage all instructors, whether TAs, instructors of record, or even tenured faculty members, to consider bringing creative options into their courses so that students can engage in a rigorous and academic way while also creating, exploring, and developing their own connections with the materials presented. I'll leave you with Albert Einstein's famous words, creativity is contagious. Pass it on.